We are here outside Madison Square Garden, witnessing a caravan of migrants invading Manhattan. I didn't think it was possible to have more white people here than a Rangers game. The last time Donald Trump had this many New Yorkers in the palm of his hand, he was doing it to impress Jeffrey Epstein. Trump rally to the right. To the right, folks. Come on. Okay. Whoops. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. Let me just stand right here. Okay, you're good. You're good. Okay. USA! USA! Look at you. My good. Look at this getup. Holy crap. I almost wore that, you know. But thankfully, my meds kicked in. <laughs> you see? Because it's absurd. Where are you two from? Annapolis, Maryland. Oh, out of towners. So tell me, since you arrived in New York City, how many times have you been murdered? <laughs> So you're a big Trump fan. Yes. I tell you what, at least Trump's the legitimate nominee. Kamala, you know, it was like a coup, right? They handed her the nomination. You're right. But she still has to get past Trump. Yes. Which for a woman is very hard to do without pepper spray. Everyone outside is like, oh, it's a Nazi rally, right? That is true. No, this is nothing like a Nazi rally. The Nazis were in shape, first of all. They took care of themselves, unlike these guy over here, right? Seriously, when I look at you, it makes me think that groceries aren't expensive enough. <laughs> I kid, I kid. It's not a Nazi rally. I hate when people use that term. When they call Trump a Nazi, right. he's the candidate preferred by Nazis. Here's another issue that uh, drives me crazy. Inflation, am I right? It's crazy right now. Can you believe it's costing Elon Musk one million dollars per voter to steal the election? It's a disgrace. The Democrats are running on abortion a lot, right? That's a big issue in this election. What would you say to people worried about losing that right? Aside from what is it like to have sex? I do not believe that they should be going across our borders. Foreigners are destroying American jobs. That is true. Did you know that just one illegal immigrant caused 6,000 people to lose their jobs at Twitter? <laughs> this guy, Elon something. Well, that's a, that's a good point. That's a good point. What's the biggest seller today? Right here. This one, this one, and all it has. You know what, though? I got some merch. What you got? If he loses, the election was stolen. What if he wins, you say? Look, the election was not stolen. Okay, how about this one? To commemorate the Trump rally at Madison Square Garden, I'm with 20,000 stupids. Arrows all around. Wow. I think it's gonna be a big seller. This is a human dog collar. A lot of Trump fans can wear this. If found, return to Staten Island. <laughs> Guys, we gotta fix you up with some merch. I'm selling merch, you know. <laughs> yeah, especially you. Here, here's what I got for you. I appreciate that, man. Trump condoms. There you go. Here, here's what they look like. You know, they have more value if you keep them in the wrapper, right. which I'm sure you won't have any problem doing. And then here, you can also have these. These are the Arnold Palmer size. I got a question for you. Are you what? going in? No, I'm not going in. I wanted to speak, but they said we don't need dogs and we have way too many puppets already. Do you love yeah. RFK Jr.? Yeah, RFK. Okay, RFK's if you great. like RFK Jr., raise your hand as far as the polio will allow. RFK is a real hero, isn't he? He's a good hero. I mean, because being a hero is all about sacrifice. And that man has sacrificed every principle he ever had to endorse Donald Trump. Um, Between him and me, that's two of us who've had their balls cut off. <laughs> How much better is Kamala? Donald Trump doesn't need notes. Donald Trump does not need notes to stand and wander around the stage while Ave Maria plays six times. You're absolutely right. You can't put a soundtrack and laughter on here. Oh, I don't need one. <laughs> Listen to those people. Listen. Let me hear it, Daily Show. Trust me, the liberals are going nuts. Yes. I'm sorry, I don't mean to insinuate that Trump is out of his mind. I'm stating it bluntly. Trump is out of his mind. USA! USA! Yeah. Joe Biden! I gotta say, it's a nice crowd, but a lot of angry white guys here. Got to admit, what do you think is less likely? That Haitians are eating cats, or that any of the guys here have ever eaten <laughs> <laughs> Trump's trying to get it. Why do you think yeah. Trump had this guy in the bathroom? No, 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 no
with a colorful New Yorker. All right, these people are out of their minds. I'm going to have to change into something that will command more respect around here. Okay, let's do this. How's everyone doing, huh? Trump, Trump, Trump. Here we go. Look at my old friend. We both took a poop on Nancy Pelosi's desk, right? I don't know about that. I don't remember. Come on. What a dump. What a dump we took in there. Here we go. We're storming the Capitol. I want to storm a Schnauzer's vagina. Who's with me? Folks, we're on the verge of something very special. Can you feel it? You know, the other side, they'll talk about record low unemployment, record high stock market, infrastructure, blah, blah, blah. But this election is more than about issues that quote unquote affect us. This election is personal. Am I right? It's about, it's about sticking it to those elitist liberals. Those elitists who hate billionaires. But you know what? On November 5th, those elitists, they're going to be the ones crying, and we're going to be the ones drinking. Yeah! Liberal tears! Liberal tears! Woo! Liberal tears! Everybody, liberal tears! I love them salty liberal tears! I won't have Medicare in two years! But at least I'll know that there's liberal tears. Liberal tears, liberal tears. L-I-B-R-U-L, liberal tears. The world's in the shitter, but I'm spiteful and bitter. We're all throwing mud in, the oceans are flooding. And just as a bonus, five billionaires own us. My candidate's lying, the planet is dying, but liberals are crying. So I say three cheers, hip hip, hooray! Cause my dream is to drown in them liberals.